In the co-main event, it was Henry Cejudo versus Dominic Cruz. Your colleague Keith Peterson was calling that fight. Dominic Cruz, after he was stopped in the second round, he had some harsh words for Keith Peterson, talking about cigarettes and alcohol on his breath. What do you make of that stoppage and that accusation from Dominic Cruz? Well, you know, fighters, I, I, I think that a fight, I, I excuse anything really that fighters say or do in the moment of a loss because people want to compete so bad. And, and these and to compete at this level, you know, it takes more than anyone ever knows. Uh, so I've had fighters angry with me or a fighter push me in a moment, I'll walk away. And then when I see them later on, everything's all right. Um, it's, it's really rough with Dominic because Dominic is such a, um, he's so good at what he does. He's so good as a fighter, as a technical fighter. He's, you know, he's changed the direction of the sport in a lot of ways. And as an analyst, he's very uh, technical. And, when, and he actually, he's one of the guys that actually go, I've actually talked to him about some of the critiques he's had of even my job and other people's job, because when he does have a critique, he has a reason for it. And, you know, so that's what I'm always looking for. I don't want someone who just says, you did a bad job. I want someone who's going to say, well, this is the reason I don't like what, what happened. And so, um, you know, I, he's someone I always want to hear from in, in that situation. Situation, well, for those reasons, um, as far as the the accusation, I don't, um, I don't, I didn't smell alcohol on Keith Peterson. Uh, Keith Peterson was around us all day, and and let you, I'll tell you this: if any of us suspect that someone's been drinking the day of a fight, there's no way that any official is going to let that pass. We're going to call someone out. This is a very serious job we do. One hundred percent. And would you have stopped the fight right then and there in the second round? Was it a right stoppage in your point of view? Well, you know something. Uh, it's it's a very it's a tough situation. And uh, you know, Dominic Cruz, uh, he wanted to keep fighting, and he uh, as they all should. And and he's a competitor. And also, he's a very uh, smart and uh, eloquent person when it comes to breaking down a situation. So I mean, uh, I, I heard the things he said. The thing about the stoppage though was. It was, it was, it was, or I would just say it's a very tough situation because um, Dominic got hurt and Dominic was looking, trying, uh, you, you know, you gotta, when someone gets hurt as a referee, you're going to, um, your job is to manage the fact, manage the threat that's coming after them while they're trying to recover and get their faculties about and be able to do the right things. And it was quite a while and there was a lot of shots coming while he was, um, while he was trying to get it together. Keith Peterson made a decision based on what he saw, and I think it fits within, uh, within the standards of, of, uh, of a stoppage. The situation changed in that split second, and that's a bad situation for anyone. So is that the situation we want? Of course not. But uh, can I, looking at it, can I see anything that he did wrong that I, that I would have done different? I, I don't think so. And, and I definitely look because we look at every stoppage, ones that other people make, ones that I make, because uh, we're always trying to figure out a way to do it better. But uh, I, at this point, I can't see anything that he could have done differently. It's just unfortunate that the situation changed in a split second, and we always want to get the right result.